everyone, I'm Katherine Martin, founder of Quiet Time Ministries. Every day, I have the privilege of meeting alone with the one who actually created me, who made the world. His name is Jesus. He is King of Kings and Lord of Lords. And this is my quiet time. Have you ever had a time when life has been unfair? You have been treated unfairly and no one knows or realizes it? If you have ever experienced this, then you most likely feel very alone and unseen in the world. I believe this was the same experience for Paul and also for the church at Philippi. They were suffering because of their love, commitment, and relationship with Jesus Christ. Paul was in prison for his faith in Christ. And the people of God in the church at Philippi were also suffering for their faith in Christ. Listen to what Paul says to them in Philippians 2, verse 10. He says, At the name of Jesus, every knee will bow of those who are in heaven, and on earth, and under the earth. Here, God is revealing something to us that we could never know unless He told us. And that's one of the reasons why the Word of God is so important for us. Our vision is extremely limited and often not based on reality. Only as we know God's Word can we really see and understand our past, present, and future. We can only know about heaven because of what is revealed to us by God in His Word. We can only know we are forgiven because God says it's so. We can only know God loves us because He says He does and He proved it by paying the price for our sin and giving us eternal life. So here God is showing us something that relates to our present and our future and helps us endure in the hard times. When life is unfair and it seems everyone around you is having the time of their lives, it's, it's just sometimes tough to take. And it's especially tough to take when the people who have treated you unfairly seem to be going on with life as usual. And you have suffered and you are broken. Here God is saying that there is going to come a day when the name Jesus is called out, and at that name Jesus, every knee shall bow. Even those who don't believe God, they will bow to Jesus. Even those who have treated you unfairly, they will bow to Jesus. Even those who are evil and cruel, they will bow to Jesus. So never get caught up in thinking about vengeance and don't allow bitterness to creep in. Just get caught up in knowing Jesus, my dear friend. Grow in your commitment, allegiance, and intimacy with Him. Every knee shall bow at His name. Let us bow at the knee now to our Jesus. Worship Him. Love Him. Serve Him. Oh, in that day, you will only have eyes for him. And oh, what joy will be yours as all are on their face before the King of Kings and the Lord of Lords. Oh, Lord, thank you for this encouragement to know that someday at your name, the name of Jesus, every knee shall bow. And that's my quiet time for this week. God bless you as you continue on in the great adventure of knowing him.